Our Lots greatest enemy. Yeah. He's responsible for the Black Monday bombing. Talk about bad luck. I just we scrubbed do it down. with our eyes shut. Yes. isn't he dear care to join more the merrier no thank you oh if i embarrassed you i'm sorry i do have that effect on people i'll wait for you but make it quick i must admit i admire your persistence almost curious what you do after i send you packing yet again You'll regret it. Sixteen-year-old Highland single malt. Modeled the year before the pandemic broke out. I've read that one barrel of this stuff sold at auction for over half a million dollars. Uh, what a sublime present.
what can I say? You broke down my defenses. So, you still after those lamps? Did Matt tell you why he wanted them? And why he really wanted them? Yeah, to take control of the TV tower. Wait, he's serious? Is he crazy? Nobody tried that for over a decade. So I guess it's dangerous. That's what the lamps are for. But lamps need electricity to run. The last I heard, the juice ain't flowing there. People have tried to take it without power. Heroes and fools alike. All ended up as volatile snacks. That's Matt's problem. What do you care? I care because something's not right. Can't you sense that as well, Aiden? Matt wants to prepare to defend the city from the Butcher's coming attack. So we should start building him a monument, right? Only problem? The Butcher isn't planning any attack. How do you know? I have my spies. Among the renegades as well. Since the end of the war, we have occupied the city center, while the colonel squats in the dam. One push of a lever, and half the city will find itself under toxic water. The colonel is not stupid. He knows war would be the end of everything. What about the UV lamps? Why does he want them, then? Jack is hiding something. For a while now, he's been ordering way more lamps than he could possibly need. And then some of those lamps always disappear. No accounting for them once we deliver. I'm not here for my health, Juan. I need the lamps to- To find out what happened to your sister. Right, Aiden? I told you I got my spies. Might be able to find something out about Waltz and your sister. Specifically about the GRE scientist you and Matt are trying to contact. I'd even say with my resources I can find this person faster than Matt. I actually doubt he's able to find them at all. Let's help each other. Smart man, Aiden. Barely in town a minute and you picked the right side already. I'll give you the lamps. That'll keep Matt from getting suspicious. But then, go to the cathedral. There's a guy hiding out there. Total nut job, but a tech savant. Get him to fix this old piece of spy tech. If we get it working, we can bug the transmitter Jack wants to place on top of the VNC spire. Have him do his thing. By tapping Matt's comms, we'll find out what he's doing with the extra lamps. And knowing he's half the battle, kiddo. Enjoy your company, but I'll need you to go now. Hey, enjoy your company, but I'll need you to go now. Time to boil the work and add the harm. Well, then at least share what you're thinking about. I hope Jack Matt deals with these damn renegades. Don't want my name ending up in some memorial down in the streets. What's the matter? I'm Hugh, and you're the pilgrim who turned on the electricity, right? Word travels fast. Mm -hmm. And word is you, you help people. Sometimes. Is that why you called me? I, I need help. 
My kid went off the water tower earlier and hasn't come back. I'm worried. Uh, how long has he been gone? About six hours now. That's a long time. Wouldn't normally worry. Oh, he's such a strong kid. Built like an ox. But it's been such a long time. <laughs> how old's your son? Does it matter? I just want my kid back. I would take care of it myself, but... Uh, but there are three young children waiting for me at home. I, I can't leave them unattended. Okay. I'll take a look for you. It's not safe here. Let's meet in my place after you found him. It's down on Lower Dam Promenade! I feel proud. Dumbass left it. Yeah.
Hey, I'm Aiden. What's your name? Match? I was asked to bring you home. What about the infected up there? There aren't any. It's safe. Then, uh... I'll just hang here. Tell Hugh I'll... Uh, be back later. Look, your father wants you home. He's worried. Hugh ain't my father. I just work for him. Like a slave. I... I don't want to do that anymore. I don't want to go back. You can't make me. And what's Hugh's real story? Never mind. I don't want to get other boys into trouble. No, it's okay. You can tell me. Stay out of it, okay? It's none of your business. Fine. I'll talk to him myself. You really want to stay here? Sure. Not my first time alone in the city. I can take care of myself. <laughs> I bet. Hey, Aiden. Thanks for clearing out the infected. No problem, kid. Ugh! <laughs> 
some kind of weird drug. Now I'm all over again. Hey, Pilgrim. I think they're the outlet. The Juan, Juan sent me on an errand into the cathedral. Is there anything I should know about? Not much. Just that people say it's haunted. Haunted? <laughs> By what? A ghost? Yeah, right. Anyway, the cathedral's been locked up for years, but there's scaffolding around it. You could probably use that to climb to a window and get inside. <laughs> Still sure you want to run errands for Juan? Might as well. Suit yourself, big boy. What happened? Where's Match? He says he's not coming back. He doesn't want to work for you anymore. What's he mean, Hugh? None of your business! You made it my business when you sent me after Match. Got me there. So what exactly are you doing with these kids, Hugh? Match seemed desperate not to come back. Fine, I'll tell you. I'm training them to survive. Come again? I've taught him to steal and spy. For you? For anyone who pays. Are you crazy, Hugh? If the peacekeepers catch them, they'll have no mercy. That's the first thing I teach them. How not to get caught. It's a fucked up world, Pilgrim. No one's gonna go easy on these orphans. I'm living proof of that. I teach them how to survive. Isn't that what fathers do for their children? Match doesn't understand that. Not, not now. He's at that rebellious age. When he makes it in the city, he'll realize it's because I prepared him. You're not gonna go after him? I'm not holding anyone here. We're family. 